Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. Imagine a machine so tiny that it can enter our cells to deliver drugs with precision or target deadly cancer cells. A team from Indian Institute of Science has moved a step ahead in that direction. Led by Ambarish Khosh, the team has created a molecular machine that can sense the presence of a cancerous cell. This machine is a helical nanomotor that can be steered using magnetic fields. It can sense, map and quantify changes in the cellular environment. The scientists created a 3D model with healthy cells and cancer cells that mimics the breast cancer environment. The team showed that their nanomotors get stuck in the matrix near cancer cells but not near normal cells. The extracellular matrix is a complex network of proteins and carbohydrates secreted by living cells into their neighborhood. But when cancer cells secrete fresh material into this matrix, the chemical and physical composition of the matrix around the healthy cells gets degraded. But when cancer cells secrete fresh material into this matrix, the chemical and physical composition of the matrix around the healthy cells get degraded. Understanding these alterations in the cellular microenvironment could be vital in understanding how cancer progresses. The study at IISC showed that as the nanomotors approached the cancer cell membrane, they stuck to the matrix more strongly than they would to normal cells. The team also calculated the magnetic field strength that was required to overcome this adhesive force. Their measurements showed that the strength of the adhesive force depended on the type of cells, the strength of the interaction and also on which side of the cell the nanomotor approached. The team also found the reason why the nanomotors appeared to stick to the cancer cells. The presence of a molecule known as 2,3-linked sialic acid confers a negative charge on the cancer cell microenvironment. Sialic acids were distributed up to 40 micrometers from the cancer cell surface the same distance until which the nanomotors experienced strong adhesion. To counter this adhesive effect, the team coated the nanomotors with a compound called PFO which shielded them from the charged environment. The coated nanomotors did not stick to the matrix near the cancer cells whereas the uncoated motors clung to the matrix. This further confirms the fact that the negatively charged cancer microenvironment interacts with the incoming nanomotors, rendering them immobile. The team says that this sticky environment around the cancer cells can potentially be used to target and kill tiny populations of cancer cells hidden among their normal counterparts. The team will now conduct these studies in living animals. This is Mohana Basu for The Print. If you liked our video, please consider subscribing to the print using the link given in the description box below because good journalism can only be sustained if smart readers pay for it.